all right this is your mama seven fast seven coupon and i'm coming at you in my car leaving out of walgreens let me tell you something now, it's been a long time since I had a story to tell you, but I have a story to tell you today. Okay, my Walgreens is the worst, like the worst. Okay, number one, I went in the store, and you know how you go to the store, and you got that one cashier that you de- you know some drama is about to happen. Yes, that one cashier was there, and I was like, oh man, that one cashier, my spirit is disturbed right now, because that one cashier there... And this is the way she do her coupons. Every time I come in there, what she do is she will literally get my coupons. She will read my coupon. She will verify that I have the right item. Then she don't scan it now. Then she will take my coupons to the manager. She will let my man let the manager read the coupons. And then the manager will ask her, Well, did it scan? And the manager, and she would say, "No, I didn't scan it yet." So she, so the manager would tell her, "Well, go back and scan it and see if it will go through." So then she would come back and scan it, and, and then it would go through. This is what she do with my coupon, like she need double verification with every last one of my coupons. Even after she read it and verify the item, she was literally not scanning it. She would go to the manager and get her approval to scan it. And the manager always say, "Did you scan it and see if it will go through?" And she'll say, oh, no, not yet. It's like, it's irritating. Okay. So, I got all this stuff. And I'm trying to learn how to do this point system and get my calculation right with Walgreens point system. Okay. And I'm I'm getting there. I'm still paying a, a, a lot that I don't, I mean, way more than what I want to pay out of pocket because the way my store is. So, I said, okay. I'm going if if I had to pay a little bit more, it'd just be a lesson learned. I'm I'm going to still figure this out because I want the coupon at Walgreens more. When it got all my stuff, this is all the stuff I got, okay. And then get to the register. Once I get to the register, she did that exact thing. And you see how much stuff I have. Do you know how much time it takes? For you to, you know, the ver- the to get the coupons, to go to the manager, to verify if you can use the coupon, then come back. I mean, that take a lot of time. Okay, so I was using the dollar all for the um, cover girls, and they had a whole lot of cover girls on clearance and stuff. Oh, my Lord. The way they got their system is if the item is on clearance, you can't use a coupon on it. So it, the system will not allow you to use a coupon on a clearance item, even if it don't exceed the price. They still won't let you use a coupon on it. It is, woo, mm, mm. She was like, "It's just to make sure y'all don't, you don't get no overs because we can't get you cash back." Okay, ma'am, do the calculation. If one one item is two nineteen, and then the other item is going to be what, at least like one oh eight or something like that. You know what I'm saying? And I use what a two dollar off coupon and a dollar off coupon. That's not exceeding the value. That's not exceeding the total. I'm still paying chain. But I'm not paying enough. I'm like, oh, uh, you know what? I said, forget it. Forget it. Forget it. I got these items. My calculations is off. At least bad $2. Um, One of my $4 off uh, um, coupons didn't come off of the um, crest. It's like a $4 off a of crest. You can even buy one crest. Uh, I mean... Two crest mouthwash, or you can buy um a crest mouthwash, or you can buy the two brushes. A lot of people are doing the two brushes, these right here. My store only had two, so I was planning on doing one mouthwash and two of these, and then this most likely would be free, and then I'd be paying change like a dollar for all of this. But it didn't work out that way because for some reason it took off a two dollar off scope um digital, and I don't even have a two dollar scope digital clipped on my own. Um, Cuba, it just everything just went crazy. Everything went crazy. So let me discuss. I'm four minutes in telling this story. I mean, when I say it went crazy, it went straight up crazy. Um, but let's go ahead and get to this. Okay. Use the shadow. Okay. So Walgreens, my total for everything I um gotten was um ten dollars and I mean a hundred and ten dollars and sixty five cent. I had a little miscalculation right there. I did the urban acid deal, which um 
was a digital so and I did a total of three I'm trying to see how many panties I got I think I did a total of how many panties I get oh I did a total of nine panties okay two four six eight yeah I did a total of nine panties and three herb acids I did um the chic razors um deal one with the trimmer because that is my favorite if you haven't tried that shit razor with the trimmer i'm telling you it would it would change your life it would literally change your life so i got the shit razor with the trimmer and then i got the fab i haven't tried the fab yet okay i got the colgate toothbrush which was bad one get one half off and the colgate i mean and the crest toupees right here Okay, see if it would have took that four dollar, I would only been paying eight eight cent, but it didn't do that. Okay, then I also got the cover girl um true blend, one wrong up for two twenty nine, the other one wrong up for two four I mean one fourteen and it was a three dollars off coupon uh and I six twenty four. And then right here I did a PG deal which was I got three pies, one downy two tags and one don which that equal up to thirty dollars and ninety three cent all of that together is what one ten sixty five i hope i did my math right okay now you see that i had messed up because i had 103 103 47 it's what i had up here at first because i had did a miscalculation but i had to add that seven dollars and um 18 cent that was from the miscalculation um for the Pantene okay so I don't want you to be thrown off by that me adding that it's because I miscalculated it was to be that amount but I put 103 okay so we got that clear up okay what I use I use six dollars that was the PG pod coupons two paper coupons that was um ninety seven dollars and forty seven cent then I use the three dollars off curva girl coupon that was in that six um twenty four smart source for the true blend um that's these right here these are marked down okay that made your total hold on what i meant that made your total 94 dollars and 47 cent then i used um six dollars off pg tad detergent coupon made it 88 dollars and 47 cent two dollars off pg on um, in the pg for the downy make it 86 dollars and 47 cent a 25 cent off coupon in the pg for the don which i got over here makes it uh 86 dollars and 22 cent ten dollars came off of the pantene the store did allow me to use two pantene coupons which surprised the mess out of me um made it Seventy six dollars and twenty two cent. Then five dollars came off of the digital with the Pantene. Makes it seventy one dollars and twenty two cent. Eight dollars came off. There was a digital coupon for the Urban Essence, and make it sixty three dollars and twenty two cent. Like I said, I miscalculated with my Pantene, so I had to add seven dollars and eighteen cent. So that made my total go back up to seventy dollars and thirty cent. Then I use a five dollars off the Chic Razor, the um, Fab, in the six seventeen Smart Source, make it sixty five dollars and thirty cent. Then a five dollar on um, Chic Digital coupon for the trimmer. It had to be the trimmer, and I'm telling you, y'all try these. I mean, it would change your life. I lie to you not. Okay, so that made your total, made my total, sixty dollars and thirty cent. Then uh two dollars off um crest not crest scope yeah crest scope coupon came off supposed to make my total fifty eight dollars and thirty cent but I'm gonna show you my receipt my receipt don't say that I'm off by two dollars two dollars really I'm off look my sub total is sixty dollars and forty cents so I'm missing something or I added too much I don't know because I took notice that it didn't take my three dollars off the pods, did not come off. So that's why I had to change that because it did not come off. And it was supposed to be the four dollars off of two that came off, but that did not come off either. And they told me just to call the corporate number and figure out why it didn't come off because they don't know. 
And then they didn't key in. No, I had a whole lot of cover girl. They won't key in it. Even if I had the right item, they won't, they would not key in it. So, yeah, it was a lot of stuff wrong with that. So, this was my total. $60.40. You see how much tax they charged me? They killed me in tax. But I redeemed $50 in points and paid the $17.10. Which, either way, I would have still had to pay around that, right, the taxes anyway. Because in that area, your points can't pay for your taxes. Okay? So, and what did I get back? I redeemed 40,000 40, in points and I got back 25,000 in points, which is right because if I would have um, been able to use all my um, CoverGirl coupons, I would have had enough coupon to actually redeem that um, 5,000 points when you spent 20. I had one of those. I would have been able to redeem that, but I couldn't because I was off by $15 in coupons. Okay? Now, in coupons, I had $50.25. Okay? So, I had enough to get the 10,000 in, um, 10,000 points. That's the, um, spend 30, get 10,000. I had enough to get that because I had, that's more than $30 worth of coupons. Okay? This one is a, buy three, get, um, 3,000 points. So, I, of course, I met that because I brought a total of 12. So, of course, I got that back. Then I also had enough because I spent fifty, had fifty in coupons. I had enough to get the three thousand for the chic razor because it was spend fifteen get three thousand. So in all, I mean that would have been only forty five dollars in coupons I needed, and I had fifty dollars and twenty five cent in coupons. So that's how I equal up to the twenty five thousand in points that I got back. Now what did I get for all of this? For the seventeen dollars I spent. <laughs> I got 12 hair care, 3 paws, 2 tags, 1 downy, 2 two brushes, 1 dawn, 1 mouthwash, 2 chic razors, and a cover girl. Now, how I'm looking at this, this bad boy right here at um, Walgreens is $16. Okay? So, it's basically like I paid for this and got all of this for free. So that's how I'm going to look at it. I'm not returning nothing. I was going to return the um, two brushes and that. Which I said I'm not returning nothing. I'm learning. The more I pay, the more I'm going to try to learn. So I can stop paying that much. So I'm taking this $17 for the team. <laughs> but let's look at it like this. Six of those dollars was taxes. So we're going to look at it like that. Anyway, this short mama 757 coupon. I will be coming back at you with a Rite Aid um, scenarios and deals and what I did at Rite Aid. I'm still not finished with Rite Aid. But I really want to get Walgreens down pat. I really do. And I'm excited that I'm kind of figuring out how you can get points and everything. So it make it kind of... It's a challenge that I like to take on. Anyway, please like, comment, and subscribe. And please follow me on Instagram. If you don't have Ibotta, I'm going to leave the link. Uh, also, sweat coins need the link. And in the questions, everything, um, please comment below. Bye.